of the incarnate word. Thy thoughts are mine. I have spoken with thy voice. My will is thine. What thou hast chosen, I choose. All thou hast asked, I give to earth and men. All shall be written out in destiny's book by my trusty of thought and plan and act, the executor of my will, eternal time. But Since thou hast refused my nameless calm and turned from my termless peace in which is expunged the visage of space and the shape of time is lost, and from happy extinction of thy separate self in my uncompanioned lone eternity. For not for thee, the nameless, worldless nought, annihilation of thy living soul, and the end of thought and hope and life and love in the blank, measureless, unknowable. Because thou hast obeyed my timeless will I lay my hands upon thy soul of flame. I lay my hands upon thy heart of love. I yoke thee to my power of work in time. Because thou hast obeyed my timeless will. Because thou hast chosen to share earth's struggle and faith and leaned in pity over earth-bound men and turned aside to help and yearn to save. I bind by thy heart's passion, my, thy heart to mine, and lay my splendid yoke upon thy soul. Now will I do in thee my marvelous works. I will fasten thy nature with my cords of strength, subdue to my delight thy spirit's limbs, and make thee a vivid knot of all my bliss and build in thee my
my proud and crystal home. Thy days shall be my shafts of power and light. Thy nights my starry mysteries of joy. And all my clouds light tangled in thy hair. And all my spring tides marry in thy mouth. O sunward. Thou shalt raise the earth's soul to light and bring down God into the lives of men. Earth shall be my work chamber and my house, my garden of life to plant the seed the divine. When all thy work in human time is done, the mind of earth shall be a home of light, the life of earth a tree growing towards heaven, the body of earth. A tabernacle of God. Awaken from the mortal's ignorance. Men shall be lit with the eternal's ray. And the glory of my son lift in their thoughts and feel in their hearts the sweetness of my love and in their acts my powers miraculous drive my will shall be the meaning of their days, living for me, by me, in me they shall live, in the heart of my creation's mystery, I will enact the drama of thy soul, inscribe the long romance of I will pursue thee across the century. Thou shalt be hunted through the world by love, naked of ignorance, protecting veil, and without covert from my radiant gods. No shape shall screen thee from my divine desire. Nowhere shalt thou escape my living eye. In the nudity of thy discovered self, in a bare identity with all that is, disrobed of thy covering of humanity, divested of the dense veil of human thought, made one with every mind and body and heart, made one with all nature and with self and God, summing in thy single soul my mystic word. I will possess in thee my universe, the universe 
find all I am in the sea. Thou shalt bear all things, that all things may change. Thou shalt fill all with my splendor and my bliss. Thou shalt meet all with my transmuting soul. Thank you.